what's good cryptocurrency fans out there welcome back to the everything altcoin channel today it's gonna be a wild day why trump just said no stimulus until after election so basically he wants you to vote for him to get more stimulus so no vote no money it's crazy what trump is doing right but anyways today we're gonna be talking about kilt protocol this is something that could be a big game changer for the cryptocurrency ecosystem in, in in general right and it's big for the dot ecosystem itself because it's just going to do something that no other cryptocurrency is doing so far and it has two components to it it has this kilt protocol and then it also has another uh, another protocol to it called polymac right so before we get into talking about Kilt Protocol, I'd like you guys, I would like to ask you guys to subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. We're on the road to a thousand subscribers. So if you guys want to help out with that, hit that red subscribe button. Don't forget to leave a like on the video, comment anything in the comment section down below. Don't forget to check out the Kusama merch, what I'm a link in the comment section down below for you guys to check out and also give you guys a little, you know, a little preview on what it looks like on the video right here. Check it out. So let's get right into the video, guys. So Kilt Protocol is a blockchain protocol for self-issuing, sovereign, verifiable, uh, anonymous credentials, right? It, en it enables trust market business models in the Web3, right? So as you guys can see, this is the Kilt website right here. Has this nice video explaining what Kilt is, which I may or may not put in the end of this video. I don't know. But you guys can also go to the website and check it out, right? So we're going to go to the little medium article that they have posted. It was a little short medium article about Kilt Protocol, which we're going to get into now. It's like a three minute read, but I've highlighted the things I want to talk about. What is Kilt? Kilt is a blockchain protocol built on Substrate for issuing self-sovereign, verifiable and revocable, revocable anonymous credentials and enabling trust markets business models in the Web3 what problem it solves kilt protocol is one of the is one of the projects that strived up for keeping personal data secure from any malicious acts it allows end users to claim arbitrary attributes about themselves get them to attested by trusted trusted entities and can store the claims as self-sovereign credentials right certificates as trustless as trusted entities can issue credentials for a fee kilt aims to foster a new business model for anyone who owns trust or wants to build up trust right so let's go down a little bit more this is basically the tokenomics for kilt kilt coin kilt coin coins could be used for transaction fees and other network related tasks total supply is 1 billion 40% to be pre-mined and distributed before launch of the network. 60 to be minted over time and would be rewarded to agents that can conduct very, uh, valuable work for the network. Now we got the second part of Polymac, right? Polymac here is another part to Kilt that actually is pretty interesting, right? Kilt Protocol introduces us to their upcoming project, Polymac, the, the Polkadot liquidity mechanism. This is going to be big for Polkadot, and you're going to see why. It's critically important. It's a critical, critically important medic mechanism, helping Polkadot projects to issue transferable pre-coin before launch of their mainnet. Right now, Polymac does not have native currency, so maintainers are only rewarded in gas fees paid in currency transferred. Right. So that's about Polymac. Right now, we're going to go to what the actual website has about talking about Polymac because they give you more in-depth details about Polymac. So we're going to get into that right here. So Polymac, uh, Polkadot liquidity mechanism, a fundraising mechanism for Polkadot ecosystem. Polkadot is on its way to becoming the basis for new crypto, for a new crypto economy as it solved many of the problems of uh, older major blockchains like Bitcoin and Ethereum struggle with. What if we could enable DOT holders to reinvest their DOT tokens into the Polkadot ecosystem to fund projects, prospective parachains, application builders, etc., and earn return on their investments in a sustainable and secure way? 
We propose the uh, Polkadot liquidity mechanism, Polymech, which is an open source blockchain uh, system designed to help get in liquidity into the Polkadot based projects that are not ready to sell transferable currencies on their own technology. It is a concept like the ERC-20 smart contract mechanism, but for insur uh, insuring pre-currencies on the Polkadot or Kusama as it en enables Polka Polkaverse projects to issue transferable pre-coins before, before it go live on their mainnet. So as you can see here, new mainnet. So essentially this is how the, the Polymech will work here, right? So how do Polymech and Kilt hang together? Polymech utilizes the Kilt protocol insurance proof and verification of KYC AML credentials. Issuers of the currency on Polymech have to make sure their first receivers are properly KYC. They can attest to this uh, to their business uh, partners and store the validity of the credentials on the Kilt blockchain. Polymet can determine this validity uh, via a Polkadot messaging mechanism before the initial fund transfer is initiated. This provides a high level of security and compliance to the issu issuers. In addition to that, Kilt will be one of the first parachain projects to issue its currency on Polymet. To that, the Kilt coin will be available to transfer before the start of the Kilt mainnet. And let's keep going. This is uh, more of the how things work on the Polymech smart uh, Polymech side, right? Then we got more here. What benefits can Polymech bring to the Polkadot ecosystem, which is pretty big, right? Polymech also supports issuers through uh, a valuable feature for initial coin offerings by monitoring the Polkadot relay chain. Polymech can associate dot transfers on the polka dot network with currency sales on uh, polymech and thus automatically distributing new currencies to the buyers currency issuers on polymech can verify uh, can certify successful kyc and aml to their initial buyers on the kilt blockchain polymech checks the, uh, the validity of these credentials during initial distribution on the kill blockchain using po uh, polka dot parachain communi communication mechanism an off chain application will be provided which also which allows the design of highly complex coin offerings on distributing schemes so as you guys can see kill and polymech could be very big for the polka dot ecosystem and I'm enjoying, I'm literally interested to see how everything works for both of these and seeing how they can actually help out the, uh, the Polkadot ecosystem because you guys know I'm very big on the Polkadot ecosystem. And this is the team here for you guys that are interested in seeing the team. They are not anonymous, they're here, they're working. So we gotta wait and see how this plays out, but just keep your eyes out on Kill. Because when it comes out, you guys should be interested in getting killed. So let me know what you guys think about Kilt. Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you haven't subscribed already yet, please do so. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So if you guys want to help out with that, hit the red subscribe button. Don't forget to leave a like on the video. Comment anything in the comment section down below. And don't forget to check out the Kusama merch. And I'll check you guys later. Peace, YouTube.